Now I'd like to show you my Hornby Mallard, which was tender driven, but again uh, I was very unhappy with its performance. Uh, it just slipped and was noisy. So now it has, believe it or not, a flying Scotsman chassis and motor on the original Mallard body. So now we'll see, hopefully it'll reverse out of its shed. And today it's pulling a rake of Great Western coaches. So there we have this modified mallard and we'll try it now around the track and see how she performs. Okay, we'll give it some some more speed just to show you. I don't like running my locusts at high speed. I try and run them somewhere close to scale. I think it's more authentic. But you see how smooth this is. And it's I've actually pulled nine coaches with it without any difficulty. My only problem is the length of track I have. So I, one day I'd like to try and see how many it can pull. The biggest problem I had making this conversion was the front leading wheels. They, that was the hardest part to set those up for some strange reason I don't know why but you see it runs very very well I'm so happy with it it's a beautiful locomotive and it for me I don't like the ring field motor and tend to drive so now I'm very very happy with this one And now we'll watch it again come into the station. A bit more acceleration maybe, just to see. Okay, now we'll slow it down. That is a beautiful runner, absolutely beautiful. This is my favourite locomotive. The control is superb, it looks right and I don't have any problems now with this pulling coaches like how it was before. Thank you for watching.